So here's a video that I've been looking forward to making for a long time, and that is an update on our backyard. Our AstroTurf and our pool is completed. California pool is just a few hours before I uh, edited this video. Uh, came out and they showed us how to maintain the chemicals in our pool. And they also gave us a rundown on how to maintain the pool equipment. While we were waiting for that to happen, we went ahead and put in our furniture in the backyard. And I'll go ahead and give you guys a rundown of uh, some of the different brands that we went with back there. But uh, at the moment, it's not um, all the furniture isn't back there. So that piece right there, that Chase Lounge chair, um, I was going to go with a different brand, but I decided to go with something a little bit more modern. It is uh, made out of aluminum and a little bit of plastic, and then there's a uh, Nesh Medding. But overall, I think it's going to go really well next to the pool. This sofa is actually made out of wicker, and it's from a brand called Modway. And then we also purchased a, a fire pit to go in front of the uh, sofa. I do also have an armchair and more than likely I'm going to buy the sofa that goes with that collection. The sofa was a little bit smaller than I thought so I think a couple extra pieces will help fill out that space. This uh, furniture under the patio is actually from Christopher Knight and then the um, little tabletop fire pit there is from Terra Firm. And then inside of there, there's a, a little gel that you actually light on fire. And then we've also installed some uh, some drapes as well, just for a little bit of privacy. And to keep the sun out while you're kind of hanging out underneath there. This is just a shot of the pool. As you can see, the little robot vacuum, in, uh, vacuum is going and doing its thing. In the middle of the Baja shelf, there's actually a, an umbrella sleeve. So if you just want it to hang out on the Baja shelf without actually going for a swim, and then also you can put the umbrella out so that the sun is just not beating down on you. As you can see, we still have a little bit of uh, work that needs to be done. There is some rock that we have to install in the back there. And then we also have to do a little bit of grading just to make sure that uh, when we do actually get rain, everything runs towards the front of the house. The side of the house over there, um, we're going to be installing pea gravel. And that's where our dog Patrick is going to go and do his business. This next clip here is just to kind of illustrate how much material had to be installed in the back. Uh, at least five inches was needed in order to kind of bring everything nice and level. And then this last clip here uh, is just the side of the house uh, that just shows that you know, again, there is a little bit more work that needs to be done. And that's where all the pool equipment is also If you at. have any questions about our backyard. If you guys have any questions about our backyard, uh, let me know. Uh, just to kind of give you an idea of cost, uh, we want California pools. We signed this contract uh, in March of 2021 before the crazy price hikes. Uh, the pool itself was 46000 And then the turf itself was $8,200. Uh, probably would have a little... It should have been a little bit more had we had them finish off the grading, but you know, overall, a pretty expensive backyard. But I think it's one of the, uh, you know, one of those investments that it's going to be well worth it. Anyways, I appreciate you watching my video. See you. Take care.